What's going on everybody? Welcome to the Punchboard Holic. Today we're doing character reviews. We will be reviewing Marvel Zombies Guardians of the Galaxy set. So in this campaign uh, or this set it's a little bit different than the others. Um, we have a different style of character. Typically the heroes are blue, the zombies are green. But in this one Thanos is only ever an enemy and he is red so haven't played it yet i know his uh he takes priority when you have to defeat a zombie so he is the focus when he comes into uh, the game so with that let's get into the character review first up we have gamora Thanos's adopted daughter. Um, I don't think there's really anything special about the base in this one. So we'll just take this opportunity to check Gamora out. It is a little weird. I don't really recall her carrying a rifle. And she's carrying one in this. So she's got a rifle and she's got her signature sword. So there we have Gamora. Next up, we have Nova. <clears throat> Nova, um, you, and not just Nova, but they all are, uh, you can tell they're fighting in space. So I'll be uh, doing something with the, uh, the base that is space related. Whether I do some wild colors, not sure yet, but we'll see. Nova. We have Groot. I'm a little sad. The big, uh, the big guy is not a zombie in the game, so that's a little uh, uh, bum me out a little bit. Maybe they'll make him a zombie in the expansion if there is or a second season. So we have Groot. I am Groot. <clears throat> Next we have Drax. Again, not much detail on the bases with these characters. Where you at? Here we go. Um, but I like how when I prime it, I think it'll really pop out. His his tattoos are just they're very prominent on him. Um. Face-wise, you can kind of tell there's something there, but it's a little difficult to see. You can see around his eyes a little bit, but there's <clears throat> there we have Drax. Next up is Mantis. We have Mantis. Here she's got some creature underneath her. Uh, very looks like it's a lively creature. Not sure what it is. But wait until you see the zombie version. Oh, spoiler. She's a zombie in the game. We have Rocket. Rocket on a rocket, maybe? Either way, he's on a ship part. Pretty standard for him. And the last hero, we have Nebula. Her, you can kind of see she's got a lot going on with her head. Um, the detail's pretty good. It'll be even better after I paint it. All right, on to the zombies. First up, we have Rocket. 
And I'll say, probably out of all the zombies in this game, he's probably my least favorite. He looks more like a rabid um, animal than anything. I mean, I think this is the first time I actually could tell maybe his ear is gone. Um, other than that, it looks like he's got some leg damage. Um, but not a whole lot of detail stands out that makes me think he's a zombie. So, rock it. We have Star-Lord. Yes, Star-Lord is only in this game as a zombie. He is in the Kickstarter exclusive box. So if you're looking to get him and you buy this set, he is not a hero in this game. But again, um, the hero f function is really a hero's resistance um, part of the game. So you really have to have that to play the heroes. Star-Lord. We have a Nebula um, zombie. Didn't know that Thanos' daughter can become a zombie, but she apparently is. Let's see if you can see her face. Got like a skeleton face sticking out. Next we have Drax. Drax actually looks like he's been um, um, like beaten by all of his teammates. We have so many swords just stuck in him. Can't tell whose they are. Looks like he's got his own stuck in him. Come on, get in there. Poor Drax looks like he's in a lot of pain. And the last zombie, we have Mantis. Now remember I said, uh, look at her, um, the creature that's around her in this version. It looks a little bit more chaotic than the other. And her face looks very scary. It's like her face got ripped off and it's just full on skeleton with a nose, with a bit of a nose. And now for the enemy in the game. We have Thanos. A little disappointed in this zombie version of Thanos. He, uh, he's got some damage, but not, not a lot. Like you see his, his arms, his leg. I mean, a little bit on his face. Sorry, this lighting is... Not the greatest. Let's see if I can do something about that. That might be a little bit better. It's a little bit of a shadow, it looks like. I don't know, but he's got some leg damage, arm damage. I'm just looking in here. You can see he's got a little bit of damage to his face right there. Whoa, come back, come back. Sorry, the zoom is really hard to get a good shot. So. Thanos. And the last two um, characters in the game, the bystanders, we have Howard the Duck. I don't know why I call him the Howard the Duck.
and Cosmo. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, consider subscribing and watching another video. If you have some time, leave a comment and a thumbs up. Thank you.